All right, in our weather forecast, we've had a lot of heat today. Our high temperatures topping out in a lot of spots, middle 90s. We're still at 93 at the airport. Dew point temperatures and our humidity should be coming down a little bit as we get into tomorrow, and then it looks like even more so later in this upcoming week. Current temperatures still most of us in the 90s with a feels like around lower triple digits for a lot of spots and also some scattered rain today. Looks like we'll have less of that around tomorrow, but if you're around Thibodeau, especially right over Homa and out toward Oak Forest and spots near the coast, some scattered downpours sinking southward and a bit of scattered, a smaller shower action over parts of St. Tammany and a little thunderstorm here has just formed south of Hammond, not far from I-55 near Lake Moripaw. Temperatures tonight will be coming down eventually into the 70s. Our rain chance will also be coming down as we head toward about sunset around 8 p.m. or just before 8 p.m. North and South Shore lows in the 70s and then tomorrow we'll do it again, but it could be a little less humid as north winds start to usher in some very slightly drier air. So our feels like temperature may be only about five or so degrees higher than the air temperature as opposed to 10 or 15 when it's super muggy. Here's our forecast with precision cast through tomorrow. Pretty quiet aside from maybe a coastal shower or storm. And then here comes this next stronger front to bring in some drier feeling air. It looks like for the middle of next week maybe even as early as Tuesday, but more so Wednesday and beyond. There's also a new tropical storm. This is Fernal way out in the Atlantic. This is not expected to make a direct hit on any land area passing east of Bermuda tomorrow and early Monday and then out to the north and eventually with shear and these cooler waters. It should be weakening by the middle part of this upcoming work week. It might strengthen a bit before it gets there with the warm waters out here, but actually the National Hurricane Center has it just barely getting to a strong tropical storm or just below category one status. Only one other spot out here a messy low pressure area forecast to move into the Caribbean Sea, but there is a lot of dry air and probably overall some hostile conditions. So that's why it has that really low chance, only 20% chance of developing in the next seven days. No threats here for our part of the Gulf Coast or the US. Note that drop in humidity should not be huge, but should be noticeable. Very nice feeling starting on Wednesday.